Alright, so um, welcome to uh, Green and Blue Productions Halloween Special for 2012. Um, yeah, it's going to be uh, me pulling around with Daisy Mod in a city, and I'm going to put the precise names of all of that in the description. And this is why I'm not going nodding up and down. And this is my um, command center, and my computer, my main base, and I have an infinity. I have a blinky uh, circuit going on, just for the teleporter's sake. So, um, yeah, I. I basically had this idea a long, long time ago that uh, it'd be fun to uh, fool around with zombies. Oh, and by the way, the, uh, the world, uh, a, a world tour of this map will be coming, like tomorrow. So, um, yeah, uh, it, this was also my first map, so I, I will get to um, possess details what the map is tomorrow. But um, yeah, um, basically, and the idea for an open world zombie map for any game. Uh, whether it be Nazi zombies of Call of Duty or Left 4 Dead, but the uh, open world city it always, you know, intrigued me. I like, I like the fact that you can go up in buildings, shoot down zombies from above, you know, stuff like that. Basically, Grand Theft Auto, but with zombies. Yes. So, um, that's what I'm going to do, and, uh, I'm, I'm going to, uh, going to teleport myself to an airport to get my net to get into an F-18 to go fly to a Vector City, uh, the name of the download, uh, name of the city and downloadable map, um, uh, from this one guy that I found going, by, uh, going on the forehands and looking, and looking, uh, I've typed in Big City and I found this RPG, um, server. I don't think it's up and running, but when it is, it, it sounds like it's going to be hilariously fun. I might do, um, an LP on that, maybe. Or playthrough. Or whatever you call it. Except for RPG ness. So, um, yeah. So, yeah, basically, uh, I guess I should give you the lowdown of, uh, what I'm gonna be doing. Um, yeah, since it's a big open world city, and although it would be fun just to run around killing people and just exploring the city, um, I, did, I decided to give myself an objective. And that objective, that objective being, uh, complete a map of the city, and if one Minecraft map is not good enough, I will simply make another halfway. And, um, I'm using, uh, also a list of the mods I'm using. I'm using the minimap mod, I think by Rosimi, which you can see in the top right. I am also u I, I wanted to use the Freerunner mod, but I'm forced to use, uh, 1.3 because I'm forced to use 1.3.2 to up that update because of the um, DC mod, which allows me to have guns, which zombie game with no guns, it's no fun. And um, also uh, allows a special version of zombie that can stay alive in the daytime, making the city making the city dangerous in the, in the daytime as well as night. So um, yeah, and um, I'm also also using mod loader, and I'm also using a uh, magic launcher. Which is a sweet thing that allows you to easily uh, keep track of the mods and putting them in the correct order they're supposed to be, so you don't need to uh, be extra cautious when uh, installing. And I decided not anyway. I don't know why, but um, yeah. So um, what else? Uh, what else do I need to tell you? Um. Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah. I'm thinking of uh, completely. I'm thinking of transforming this map into something that's uh, to a zombie. Complete the monument where in different sections of the cities I will put a, a certain type color of wool and you have to find it. So yeah, which is um ba which will be of course based on uh, fixes monument and I'll be probably using his monument building kit. So yeah, but that but, but that's not going to get finished at least till the mid spring, at most next Halloween. So yeah. But um, you can feel free to download this map, help the help the guy out, and look at the and look at that one clan RPG server forums and check that out. Maybe you're interested in that kind of stuff. So um, yeah, you download the map and probably download DayZ and download mini map and just come around and just fool around too. But um, yeah. So uh. I guess, uh, let's get started. Oh yeah, and by the way, I'm probably going to do this on one death. If I die once, but if I die way too early, I'll probably just, just, you know, respawn and continue. So, um, yeah, no, no problems with the one death thing, but, um, but, uh, 
Uh, is there anything else? Uh, yeah, I gotta complete the map. I wanna make this to a complete monument later. Maybe add some spawners, stuff like that. Uh, anything else? Um, I don't think so. Let's get this started, because I wanna get this started. So, uh, let's get in the teleporter. Get the right camera for this. Let's get in this teleporter. All right. I'll see you when we get there. All right. So, um, well, uh, we're here at the start. You know, by my F-18. Uh, and um, what's in these chests? Well, extra ammunition. I, I want to hurry because this is 9:19 in the morning, and I need to get out of here. Uh, I I did make myself a little starter base, even though I I don't I intensely don't want the and uh, I don't necessarily plan to release this map, but uh, I might as well give me a start place just for the tutorial. And this is what I start with. Uh, yeah. Because basically the map I'm going for is have fun, kill everything, complete the monument, not necessarily build up just like uh, and, and like how Vic does it. But uh, the government of Victor City Outpost. Because you know, they gotta go somewhere because the entire city is taken over by monsters. This is the starter base. You have the crew uh, basically the surviving government people of course they had mass uh, evacuation as you can tell by all the planes outside but um yeah this is basically uh, a good, a good uh, self, uh, self efficient place I forgot to put on the texture pack so uh, be right back alright so this is what it's supposed to look like this is uh, my room Biggest room I've actually made it. So, um, yeah, basically, the story is, uh, there was the zombie invasion, something happened. Holding that concerns one of their lamps, it exploded or terrorist attack, not quite sure. Food, infinity food supply, I, it just, it started this entire, the entire inside, because the hangar was here, that's why the plane was outside. This is, this is, um, uh, the hangar is just part of the map, I just added everything on the inside. So, um, uh, yeah, I it started with the emotional print, and I thought maybe I should put some support crew, put them there, then say I need houses for them, because they're NPCs, so I give them houses with, quote, wood, wood doors. So this is their offices and houses, and I uh, got a little place for eating, got the, um, this is where they cook stuff, two guys' pl uh, place, this is actually a very, very nice place for in the survival situation they're in. They got mushrooms or infinity mushroom soup. Um have this farm for the player for wheat and um millions. I also have um wheat maybe reading although I would need to update this for one point four. Um wheat for making extra maps because I'm pretty sure I those are needed. And um so yeah this is what this is the starter place. And now I'm thinking of making um, a version of the map to go with the AZ mod or any other gun mod. Maybe the maybe the AZ mod and uh and another one to uh, go with uh no no more Minecraft so no more Minecraft people who don't know how to mod, but know how to put maps in can do it though. Yeah, I definitely want to make like three or four maps. So uh, here we go. Here's the start. So uh oh, you know what? I need to turn on that, and I'm going to turn on the playlist. After dark, so um, yeah, this this map is sweet. Now I and now also what makes this challenging right now, as opposed to uh capture the uh, as opposed to just capture the wool is I have to have the map out in order to map things. So yeah, I, I have to have the map out in order to map things, which is bad. Those are zombies. Attract their attention. So, um, which makes it harder than Capture the Wool, where Capture the Wool is, you can just go to the place and, uh, grab the wool and run, instead of having to have the map out, walking slowly, making sure you don't get shot. Now, switch reactions to get to your gun. This is a little, actually, this seems a little harder to me than I thought. Yeah. I mean, uh, what the guy did is he made the entire town elevated a little bit, so... He basically used a super flat biome, at least to what I think. 
and then he moved the entire, and then he up level, and then he, uh, moved everything up a little bit. See? So, um, as long as you don't go to the edges like that, you, you know, it's pretty good city, although you can always add them. So, well, I'm not, I'm not kind of going down there and actually filling out the map completely. I'm just kind of about this city. Um, uh, sure, I don't know. I don't want to kill me. Oh, yeah, notice those are zombies and they're spawning in the daytime. That's not part of the texture pack, by the way. That's tech. That's not pa part of the texture pack, by the way. That's actually, um, uh, those are actually Daisy zombies. I gotta be real careful on those guys because I'm pretty sure they have increased sprint. And with my shotgun, with, um, uh, Deer slug, it's about there are two hits. So yeah, oh you know this, I've got ammo by at least. Oh my, where'd you right there? You know, in DZ they are hyper fast Halo zombies. Although it, also in DZ they have uh, enormous amounts of health for some unknown reason. Snap! That's not mine. That's the minger. I could die right here. My word, it's spawning over the- Oh my word, it's getting more tasty than I thought it would be. Okay. And now, um, as you can see, those green dots are my NPCs. Uh, although I could make this into a radar by making it so, uh, enemy entities... So making it so en enemy entities also, uh, show up, but... Ah, that's a tid bit too. That's a, a tad bit too cheap for me. I thought I can always turn it on. Check your corners. There's somebody right there. So you got limited ammo. I am wearing iron armor, by the way. I decided to give myself some armor. Because I don't know what these guys can do. Map, map check. I check yourself before I, they kill myself. Oof, it's getting night. Uh, nighttime, as far as I can tell, uh, the Daisy zombies don't spawn more. It's just that you have to worry about uh, normal monsters spawning, so. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and, uh, lights apparently don't matter on this map. I don't know why, it's just. See, all, see, that's glowstone. All the yellowish blocks are glowstone. And the zombies don't care. Man, I really should make this into a map so you guys can download it. Because it's, it's getting bad. Oh, yeah. Um, I didn't add some of these creatures because I kills them a lot. So, see, there's torches and the lights everywhere. But it don't matter. Creeper spotted! Alright, and what I also like is I have backups upon backups upon backups of this map. So, um, if something explodes, and I, I mean, I can just not worry about creepers glowing. Because I'm not scared of the creepers, I'm scared of the damage from the creepers. I don't like it. Too many places for things to spawn. Okay, now it's some turn of music. Creepy music ho! Oh yeah, um... I can't necessarily uh, have this music in a down- in a- I don't know, because I just put too many in this playlist. But, um... Oh yeah, and thank, and thank you Bungie343, uh, uh, Marty Donnell, and Microsoft for uh, letting me use Halo music at my discretion. Oh yeah, wait, wait a second. Wait a second, people. I gotta turn up my normal volume. Fifteen, which is what I determined was the best. Okay, now connection. Six. Your spiders. Snap! I almost got snapped by skeleton. I'm playing this in normal mode. Okay. I have cheats on, so uh, I can go grave mode and mess around the map.
Now, uh, and that a creeper spider's gonna just jump off the building 50, so. I really feel like turning on Entity's Radar, but I, have, I haven't died yet. And I'm successfully dodging all the stuff. So. Yeah, uh, we'll be best for this mod since... I mean, we'll be best for this map if I had a vehicle. I, I, try, to put, I try to get the mods with the vehicles to work, but they just don't work. Alright, so that, that, that appears to be all mapped out for me. That's close enough. I can go on those peaks and finish them in the daytime. It's going to off here. Oh, this is all dark right here. Man, guy, you suck at last. Uh, sp uh, spider jockey! That's, oh, snap! And he saves my retreat! Retreat! Oh, snap! I forgot he's a spider jockey. Suck it! Here. First victim down. It had to be a spider joke, damn it. Oh, normal spider! Alright, um, what I did was, uh, for the texture pack that comes with this mod, all the enemies are bloody and red and weird looking. So I decided to use the find. And the spiders appear white for some reason. I don't necessarily know why. Uh, I can I actually go back and fix that later. If I, if I do, uh, I should be pretty safe up here. Oh yeah, I, I did. I wish I wish I had a free runner right now. I could just grow up right, right up that wall. You know, I'm going to turn down the music a little bit. I did just, just a tad. I, I really hate flap, fraps for the. Uh, I really hate fraps um, for one reason and one reason alone is I can't adjust the volume. Alright. Let's break it. Alright, doors, good. Oh, oh, by the way, these uh, glass doors are wind doors. Hey. I mean, this is the fun part about actually playing on the map that you don't care about because you can have five copies. I might want to make five copies, okay? In here, pre yeah, in here is pretty good. Light, lit up so I can just more careful. Although, a creeper could be sneaking over behind me. Not. I mean, look, notice that you put hash slabs above all the saplings to make them to, uh, Make them remain sla uh, saplings. Alright, I got almost all the airport all done. Hmm, when I broke those. In the chest. That would be a, um... Workbench. Yeah, I mean, with this, uh... With this map, you can easily... Use, uh easily use default textures, but uh, some things like the computer screens are not there in default textures. They are actually um, uh, they are actually the computer screens normally are pumpkins. Okay, and uh, and uh, the wood doors are um, all right, indoors. Okay, I was looking for staircase, so I didn't break all this pretty glass. And that's time, so, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, like, like, if you dislike, dislike the video, helps you when they're searching through videos, and, uh, please leave a comment. Tell me if you would like to see this map in your, um, save games anytime soon. Yeah, I mean, if you want, I, cr I could try to figure out how to get this thing on the download site, and then I could let you guys download it. Um, because this is a pretty neat, neat map. 
Although, basically, I didn't do much to it. And, and if you, you do request it, I will um, have to go back and make it so it works with normal Minecraft 2. But, um, yeah, I mean, it's still, you can still play it by the same objective if the map. But, um, yeah, so, look. Uh, I guess, see you in a second!